finally. What the f- <laughs> Time to see where this really is. What the? What? Huh? Get <laughs> Chào anh em là em là con gái miền Tây mới lên thành phố được có được có mấy ngày nhìn thấy xung quanh người đông đúc xe cộ sao mà bỏ lúc nhục không như quê em quanh năm khung cảnh yên bình. We in our first location we're at Cafe Noir and H O I don't know how to pronounce it but. I've been brushing up a bit of my Vietnamese and I always like to start off the day with coffee so I'm gonna have Vietnamese coffee, Cafe Suda. So I'm pretty excited for that. We're gonna start off here in the cafe. Let's go. I'm gonna say hello to my friend. High five. <laughs> Cafe Suda. Cafe Suda, what's yeah. small? Okay, very nice cup. Now for the taste test. That's good. So it's very, very sweet, but I really like it. Because they it's sweet because they make it with condensed milk. But that's what makes it even better. It might be too sweet for some people. But I don't know. I still like it though. They also sell dessert here, but we might come later for dessert. So I don't know yet. We'll see. Let's keep going. Someone save me. Won't wake up on my own enemy. Blank. You know a good bun me spot? Bun me spot? Yes. I don't know. But there's a bun me over there. Best bun me? Which one's the best? I only want the best. From Cabramatta. I'm not sure. From a Cabramatta local. I think the one near the city. It's right over there. Over there? That way, where is it? Where is it? Just go through over there, you will see a city and a uh, coffee. Shetty? Okay, we'll go. Thank you. See what I'm doing right. Yeah. Um, yeah, what's the best one? Uh, yeah. Okay, can I get that one? Huh? French chili. French chili? Fresh. Fresh chili? Uh, just a little bit, a little bit. Thank you. Cut? Yeah. <laughs> We're here with the bun mi. Let's go. Okay, we got the bun mi. And we're trying it for the first time. We've got a pork roll. Oh, this is the very famous one. But yeah. Hello, hello. Yum, yum. Who doesn't like pork belly? Mm. Mm. This is good. I like how the sauce just goes with the pork belly. I'm just... They put Vietnamese butter too, which just made it so much more better. And they have this like white long thing. I don't know what it is, but it's good. This thing right here. But yeah, the pork belly, I give that an eight out of 10, nine out of 10. I don't know, maybe some barbecue sauce. I don't know if it's, a, if it's right to say that. Maybe not, but it's good though. I like it. It's pretty filling though, even for a big bun. Cause it's like a, it's a baguette bun. So it's pretty thick. But I love the pork belly. But that's not it yet. We're gonna move on. We got third to try. Let's go. We've had some appetizers, we've had some drinks. We're now here for some pho. Pho is... We're gonna find out what pho is first. Okay, we're now at Pho Pho Thao Bay. What's the, what's the best thing to get? Beef pho. Beef pho, yeah, get one beef pho. And anything, anything else good? Okay, that's it. Perfect. Just one, huh? Yeah, can one. Thank you. Yeah. 
Ui, thank you. Good, good soup. Good soup so far. We'll taste the beef and the noodles, which what really makes the beef fun. Okay, let's go. Mmm. I think what really makes it is the soup. The soup just does it well. And the green onion just makes it well. It's salty, which is nice. Good to pair it with tea. But yeah, definitely seven out of 10, eight out of 10. I don't know, because I'm not, I don't know how it's supposed to taste, honestly, but because I'm not a local, but I think it's good. Oh my gosh, the man, the filmer just spilled the fur. They're gonna think we did it on purpose. Oh, I'm so sorry. Sorry, it's not Show me how you spilled all the fur. Go. Like, I was Why carrying it, it from there. Oh my god, you just slide it. Yeah, I should have just slid it. I'm done. Yo, even though they're giving us looks, weird looks because we're filming, they're still so nice though. Everyone's really nice at the store. Very good fur. Yeah. We're here with the official zaddy. What do you rate the <laughs> <laughs> How's the fur? Oh, honestly, how's the fur? Um, I feel like this is like the top rated fur. Yeah. In Cabramatta in the area. What's so, this? Should we go here? Wait, here. Yeah, this place is not bad as well. Should I try? Should I go it? You should try here as well. What is it? What, what should I get here? Um, it's like rice noodles mm -hmm. mixed with spring rolls and vegetables. Yeah. You put fish sauce in it, it's so good. It's crack off. Oh, so it's rice paper rolls in India? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. We might try the rice paper rolls. But this is good. This is it really good? Yeah. How'd you like it? It was good. I liked it. I liked the... We had the beef fur. Yeah. And it was pretty good. Um, the soup was nice as well too, so... Yeah. 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 Anyways, thank you. Thank what was you your name again? Ryan. 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 Nice yeah. to meet you. Tasty. I'll see you. Thank you, thank you. Here? Just one? Just one, yeah. We're now at Foy Uk. We ordered the rice paper rolls, which is a delicacy here. Not in Vietnam too, but in this place. So, pretty excited. Excuse me. How do you pronounce the name of this place? Foy Uk? Uk? Phu? Uk? Uk? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Thank you. I'm already an expert at Vietnamese, so that's what they've been saying. Fish oil? Yeah, that's the reason. Fish sauce, fish sauce. Yeah. I really like it here because you can do it DIY. So you basically put the rice paper roll in the hot water and they cook it for you. I don't know. I saw in a video they did it they did it in cold water or normal water, but maybe hot water is the way it is. Can you show us how to do it? Sorry? Can you show us how to do it? Cut the sugar cane. Cut? Yeah, cut the sugar cane. Cut it? Yeah. Like this? Yes. Like this? Like that? Oh, okay. Yeah. What is this? What is what mood mean? No, the sukin pork. Sukin pork. Pork. Prawn. Yeah. yeah. And then turn it around. Yeah. Steam rice. This is much. This much. Okay. Oh, that's a lot. Uh, vegetables. Yeah. Um. Yeah, wrap by yourself. Like this? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Thank you. Enjoy. Enjoy. Yes, you too. That looks like a zaddy roll. That's how we do it. Mm. It's good. I like it. I like how everything just complements each other. Kind of like a bun me. I think Vietnamese food is good with complementing different, 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 different. Vietnamese food is good with complementing salad and meat, not meat, well, meat maybe, and like just different things together. Because this all just fits well together. And I love it. For a cook, which is the place, this is good. You guys should come here. I don't know if I can finish all this. Here we have the prawn, lovely prawn and carrots and some rice. You're supposed to put it in the rice paper roll. And that's it. Which one? Which one is the hoisin sauce? Yeah. Hoisin? Hoisin sauce, okay. Thank you. 
I love this DIY because if you don't do it DIY, you don't know how much you want. So that's good. A little bit of green onion, carrots, essential part to make it vegetarian. Other onion. And that's it. Hoishan, hoishan sauce. Hoishan. I don't know how to pronounce it, but it'll be fine. That's good. That's amazing. Hoisin sauce just adds a little bit more sweetness. Fish oil is still good. It's okay to be in my video. Say hi, Zaddies. We're going multicultural in this channel. We're going to see different cuisines. If this, if you guys want more of the, of more food. But yeah. Anyways, that was rice bread. I was gonna keep eating a bit more because I kind of like it. I actually, actually love it. It's so yum. But yeah, we'll keep eating more and see more. I think maybe next we'll have some dessert. What are you guys up to? I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump, I'm gonna jump, I'm gonna jump you on at the city, bro. You jump me? What back are Indian, Indian. Indian? No, I'm Viet, I'm Viet. Oh, you're Viet? No, no, no. <laughs> I heard this is the spot for dessert. It's a coffee shop. Oh, it's a coffee shop. Yeah. I thought there was like a waffle thing you guys saw. Sorry? You sell waffle? Oh, we don't have that, sorry. Finished? Oh. The waffle shop is lit. Oh, sorry, is it? Okay, sorry, that's awkward. <laughs> Um, what's the signature thing here? Oh, pancake. Is it Vietnamese? No, Chinese. Oh, Chinese. Oh, okay, I'll have it. Okay, I'm sorry. This, this is not Vietnamese. I know we're in Little Vietnam because it's Cabramatta, but you know, I couldn't resist. Like, look at it. Literally, look at this. But, okay. We're gonna go. We got some boba. I don't know what this is called. Oh, it's a creme brulee. Okay, let's go. Okay. Whoa. I need to find out how to say tasty in Vietnamese because this looks. Mm. Oh my god. Have you ever had creme brulee with boba? This, this is actually a beast collaboration. Not collabor beast combination. Beast combination with just creme brulee and boba. And it just works. Creamy, yummy, and yummy. Let's keep going. Watch me devour this. Cameraman want some? It's basically, it's Chinese, but we came here for a little Vietnam, but it's fine. Boba and creme brulee. Honest, honest review. Woo. Honest review. What do you guys reckon? I'll give that like. An 8.5. 8.5? Out of 10. Easily, bro. Easy. Oh, How can we make it a 10, honestly? Yeah, but that is good shit. <laughs> That's like, it's like nice and warm. It's crunchy as well. Easy. Right. Easy, boys. Thank Easy. you. Hindi music. Hindi music. Yeah, I like Indian music. I come from India. India. You? Ah, okay. I come back in five minutes, you dance. Well, that's been Little Vietnam. Honestly, it's been a really great session. I've had Vietnamese food, I've had Vietnamese drinks, and honestly, it's just been a great experience. But yeah, leave in comments, leave in the comments if you should come back and if you go see more. But yeah, I still love how there's even Bollywood people in Cabramatta. Well, a little Vietnam, but still. But, yeah. <laughs>